Hello everyone. Uh, hi. So my name is Timur. This is my wife Tatiana. So today we want to demonstrate um, how to induce a hypnotic trance. And Tatiana happily volunteered. <laughs> she didn't really have a choice. <laughs> and uh, it's something very pleasant actually. And it's something that you, you can do with your uh, relatives or friends, uh, it's really a very pleasant experience. So, so relaxing. it's uh, very relaxing, yeah, very relaxing. And so, instead of like, I don't know, watching TV for a while, I will not even start. Some, some TV programs are good, sometimes just waste the time. Uh, so, you can do that and uh, not only do this. Um, like for fun but you can actually achieve uh, some positive goals that you can have in your life like better sleep or to improve relationship with your boss or to be more uh, concentrated when you work on a project or something on when you want to prepare spark creativity for something if you need to write something or create a piece of music or painting yeah, so if you want to create a piece of music, do that. <laughs> Maybe a project. Yeah, a project. And uh, so my first question for Tatiana will be, do you have any particular goal uh, for today's trance? Um, I don't know. Maybe I will just... Uh, I'd like to relax. And, um, nothing specific. Just relaxation, mm. general relaxation, okay. Because we, we have a three-year-old. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Relaxation is a is very important For us, process. yes, to, to stay calm. <laughs> uh, so first, uh, I noticed that you already have your both feet on the floor because it's much easier to go into a hypnotic state uh, when you have both feet on the floor. And you can do this with your eyes opened, or if you want, you can at some point close your eyes. And what I will ask you to do is just maybe put your hands like this for a moment. And we'll do some simple breathing technique that will help us to achieve the first stage of relaxation that you're after. And we will do small pauses between our inhalation and exhalation. Very good. So when you inhale, you make a pause. And when you exhale, you make a pause. And to set a rhythm to these exercises, you can just Maybe expand a little bit your hands when you breathe in. Just a little bit. And yes, and your hands may come toward each other when you breathe out. And these movements can really be very relaxing, very small movements. And you may notice that as you do this, the tonus of your muscles has changed and you started to be more relaxed already, very good. And you can continue paying attention to your breathing or maybe switch your attention to maybe another part of your body, maybe to your feet, and notice how your feet are touching the floor, and then maybe you can direct your attention to your legs, and feel how your legs 
started to change their muscle tones already mm -hmm, very good and as you slowly move your attention up you start to notice changes in your body and realizing how pleasant this experience is and how deep you can go to help you relax that's right maybe at some point your your hands will start moving down toward your laps maybe they will continue doing doing this movements that started this exercise very good and as your hands move down you can let your body relax even more very good because this type of movements is already an indication that right now the state of consciousness has changed that you achieved some good hypnotic trance that can allow you to learn something learn how to relax even more very good mm -hmm. and you can allow your mind wonder maybe you remember some pleasant experience from your past because we all have pleasant experiences sometimes we can remember them to achieve the same state for example I'm pretty sure that some time ago you went to a beach and when you go to the beach you can really switch your mind to completely different environment compared to what you experience regularly on the beach there are a lot of things that are quite different first of all we have a lot of space around us a lot of open space a lot of fresh air a lot of interesting sounds and you can start paying attention to these sounds Mm -hmm. and notice how these sounds may relax you even more and when we spend some time at the beach at some point we tend to get a little bit tired maybe and we want to lie down to have a rest and I invite you to find a comfortable place where you will be lying 
for some time and really relax. You can forget about everything and just bring your attention to all the muscles in your body feeling how relaxed and heavy your limbs are and at some point you will again switch your attention to the sounds on the beach and the sounds can be entertaining maybe they will help you to distract yourself and to find a good rest and when you're ready I will ask you to find maybe other things that you can do on the beach that will help you to find solutions to the problems that you may have because when we do something completely different it activates different paths in our brain and we start to think what they call think outside the box and to do that we need to do something completely different something that we never really did before but something that is still quite interesting and that we want to do maybe you wanted to do it for a very long time but hesitated during this pleasant experience now you can do it you can really experiment with your behavior and do something that you've never done before mm -hmm. that will help you achieve your goals especially your goal to relax today and now and for some time you can continue doing what you do right now and when you think you're ready you can take a deep breath and come back to this room fully refreshed ready for new adventures in your life So, hello. How are you? I'm very good. Really relaxed. This is the type of relaxation that we rarely achieve in our busy lives. I feel like I'm heavy. At the same time, it's the state when you have control and if something happens, if there is a fire alarm, you're always yeah so you, you return to your normal state quick yeah so like if something goes on <laughs> so the, the, usually the person is like awakened like very quickly so it's a question of choice so i choose to be relaxed and i choose to wake up so it's really interesting state. 
Yeah, so uh, like Tatiana said, yeah, it's really, it's not that I like <laughs> control her or something. I'm helping her in her particular goal. Her goal was uh, to relax. So I'm using my voice uh, and using and giving some uh, spe of special language. type of language. Yeah, I'm make it easy for her to relax because if she wanted to do this uh, on her own, probably uh, she wouldn't be able to uh, go into this profound relaxation state. But by yeah, it takes a lot of practice. practice, yeah, if you practice meditation something like this, you may be able to do this by uh, on your own. But uh, it's m for most people, it's quite difficult. So during this type of uh, sessions we help really uh, for me hypnosis is like <laughs> you know, the easiest way to help another person to achieve uh, uh, his or her goal so that's it for now uh, and stay tuned maybe you'll see more sessions coming from us so have a good day bye, bye.